what's up guys welcome back episode four resident evil three we're getting down we're getting into the thick of it uh, we're sitting there with jill we just beat nemesis there's all sorts of crazy noises happening in the background um if you had followed along with the last episode oh my god what a banger that thing was that, that was a hell of an episode shit was everywhere let's just check this out quickly let's get sh let's crack straight into it and um we'll continue on I hope you guys are enjoying the, the playlist. I, I definitely am, and I'm looking forward to getting deeper into this game. I need to stop with those noises. God damn. Shit. Alright, I don't think there's anything left here. In terms of items. I'm not sure if we can go out back either. Better not be Sherry. Can't be Sherry. Discarding items, you can discard items that have served their purpose or any other item keys that are marked with the rubbish with the rubbish thing on them. Okay. Discard items. If you fucking wake up, I swear to god. I don't know who you think you're messing with. Here's one of these things again. What the fuck? That thing has a long ass reach. You don't think I'm letting you slide, Mr. Bobblehead? Relax your body. I don't know what the fuck's in here. We ain't going straight outside either. See, it's the little things like that, you know what I mean? Like, I like the fact that even though that you lockpick, um, it's little, you know, you know, little things like that that, you know, make a big difference in a game. And I think they're a great feature. You know, the thing could have just disappeared be <coughs> because it served its purpose. So, you know, we've picked the lock and the lock is open. It could have just disappeared and it would have been none the wiser. But the fact that they let it sit on the ground like that is, is really cool. That realism aspect is, is really, really cool. Man, 
it was a stupid idea trying to get back to the fucking top shelf. Jill, you okay? Carlos, that monster's on my ass again. Are you shitting me? I thought you killed it. Me too. Which is resilient. I give you that right there. Okay, we're still fine. Let's take a quick check. It doesn't look like he's gonna follow you. So I just wanna shit like that, you know what I'm saying? Like, you're gonna miss stuff like that if you rush through the game. You're gonna stay calm, cool, calm, and collected. It says I'm fine, but I'm limping. Oh, this is gonna bring us back here. Nice. Not, not worth using that thing yet. Lead him right to you? It's okay. Trust me. It's weird how you can't combine red herbs with red herbs in this one. I didn't know where to go there. I don't remember where the... How do I see... Map. So I'm here, right? The donut shop. The pharmacy? How do I get to the cop shop? So it's blocked off here. It's blocked off here, so we have to come down here and then the head comes down. Hmm. Alright, get it. So the zombie went through there.
die. for a second here where the hell did this man find a fucking anti-aircraft fucking rocket launcher we get these pissy ass little fucking weapon attachments and this motherfucker knows where there's anti-aircraft rocket launchers shit Out of here. Whew. What a mesh. Fuck, I don't even know what death. I think that's death four? Death five? I don't even know anymore. Shit's hectic. Carlos, I know we didn't get off to a great start, but thanks for the save. Yeah, you come on, fuck. You come on, fuck. Save that my one, ass so first. Up. You're a hell of a lot braver than me. You come up clutch there, big well, fella. What matters is that we can get everyone out of the city now. Yeah. Now you'll be safe. I'm checking this first. Okay, this is all done. This is all done. We still don't have a fucking uh blue gym. I don't think I can save her anymore. Yeah, come on, triggering. Uh, but man, how many fucking red herbs do I have? Uh, put those away. Actually, take out, take out, combine. Boom. Do I have any? No. I don't have any um other gunpowder to store that as well. So I've got three explosive. Oh, there's more, there's more bullets than my shotgun. I like the shotgun too. What about you? Check the south of it. I won't be catching the train. Why not? Now there'll be new orders. If it means I can help save the city, it's fine by me. Right, what are you gonna do? There's no more barbers left in the city. Goddamn shit, you gotta like clean that mop up. Like an old mop head. Chivalry, ladies first. Good work. Your reputation is well deserved. Get inside. The subway's about to leave. Carlos, Tyrell, you have your orders. You need to go back out into the city and find Nathaniel Bart. This isn't the last ride out of town, right? Do not worry. Once the civilians are safe, the train will be back. It's all right. You're going ahead. I'm not gonna die on you, leave you in a cold, cruel, Carlosless world. Okay. 
You'll need to find this scientist. His vaccine research could save us all. You see? You're learning. The only life that matters is your own. Good luck. Let's go! That man looks like Dildo Baggins. Carlos looks like he came out of the Shire. He looks like a buffed up Samwise Genji. The same. Okay. You don't really think a pencil pusher like Barton is still alive, do you? I have a done good authority. Why? Are you worried about teammates? Or something else? Funny how brainless zombies can ambush a platoon like that. Funny the gate was locked. What you think? <laughs> he looks like Wesker. What was that? No fucking way. How is this fucker not dead yet? Yes, no, they're gone. Yup, this way. This dude is crazy. Nikolai, what are you doing? It's not after you. <laughs> Nikolai! Subway's got to be clear of the city by now. Along with your hot date? Nah, she's not like that. Hell, she's not like anybody. <clears throat> oh, we get to play as Moped. All right. Keep your head screwed on, Romeo. Oh, dude, this is, this is like... You sure? It looks like a cemetery to me. This is like, um, Leon's storyline. Oh shit, it is like Leon's storyline. Ah. Oh my god. Brad, stop! T. <laughs> Come on, man. Now you too. Oh, that's, that's the cross. Oh, sorry. Shit, it's locked. That's how he got there. You stay on the door. I got this fucker. Come get some. How particular I'm being with my shots. Brad Vickers. These stars. That could be useful. Oh, this is just like we're heading into like Resident Evil 2 territory here. Oh my god. Where'd that cop go? Don't know, don't care. Got a job so to do. familiar. If our intel's still worth a damn, then Bard's in the star's office. Let's find him and take him into custody. Custody? I thought this was a rescue. Carlos, take a look at this. I've located the star's office. Remember, Bard had access to Umbrella's darkest secrets. He knows we'll try to keep him under our thumbs. So this search and rescue mission is really more like find and detain. 
Hmm. Right. Good to know. I'll open the shutter so you can get through. You stay here and find out what's been going on here at the station. Call you if I find anything. Hey! Be careful. Yeah. You too, man. Okay, so I do have... Carlos! Have a look. Let's see if there is uh, symbols on the doors. Oh my God, there is. A symbol now here's on. a weird fucking door. Leave it. We're here for Bart. Oh, oh, the fucking the uh, medallions have been blocked off. That's pretty cool. Look, they have. Look, even the lion statue's been blocked off. Here, it looks clear. That's wild, man. I like it. See, I like how it ties together. That's, that's kind of cool. Oh, this door's been blocked off as well. You can't go through there. I'll we'll check these areas first. That's wild to think that we're back in here. I wonder if we're going to find that big monster dude. Hit that. Key. Yep. No. Mel Marvin? Melvin. Well this must be before Jill gets there then. Thinking about it, like Melvin's just been bit. So this must be before Resident Evil 2. Uh, no idea. Security ID protocols. Um, each member of the force of initial with an ID card. For now on the same card will require to access these storage boxes. Alright. So I guess. Oh. Kill. Assault rifle ammo. Good shit. <laughs> oh no. What the hell was that thing? Not them again. They're like my most hated enemies. I'm just saying, I'm fucking, I'm unleashing on this thing. Oh, that's how that dude gets there. Okay, fair I'm enough. A bit of zombie. Club key. I never found the club key. Stick around. Uh, here we go. That's it. PD, welcome. Oh, I'm waiting for this thing to pop out, guys. So the chain should be on the door. No, the chain's off the door. Okay. Yeah, that's one thing I never got. It's a club key. Actually, you know why? It's because I didn't go back. I bet you if I went back with that handle um, in Resident Evil 2, I probably would have got the club key. So that window's not smashed either. I remember that was a shortcut for um for Jill. Okay, let's go. Take that. No ammo. Okay. 
Okay, the spike, spike he was found level three. Hammer, yeah, the spike he was. T, you copy? There's something real nasty in here. I don't know what it is. Something nasty. All right, I'll take a look with the cameras. Watch your six. Good loot in there, safety deposit boxes are in there. What is that? Oh, let's go. Oh, that's gangster. Be a gun I'd use on Tarkov, too. God damn. Yeah. You get back the fuck up, or you get smacked the fuck up, motherfucker. Shit. I need to be opened on this one. It's so weird being back in this this office. A rest report. The explosive collected from the suspects appear to be extremely powerful. As a safety precaution, the battery was removed from one of the detonation devices upon its uh, admission into evidence. The battery was secured in a safety deposit. Okay. So we need to get in there. That's a must. I don't think we can link up here yet. But there's a spade key.
like this AR, it just doesn't hit as hard as you think it would. Things gonna come out now. Kind of fucked up shooting cops. Internal memo nine fifteen seven now. Yeah. Kill those things, I'd be set. <laughs> Did it make a difference whether the light was on or off? No. Okay, upstairs we go. I'm already dead. If you hear any noises coming from a locker, do not open it, please. Um, while you're out on patrol, I focus on finding a way to get to, get to the other side. I realize that this place might be the part of this. I managed to rig up some pretty good bomb. We don't have any batteries for the detonator. I'm okay, so the C4 and Resident Evil 2 had the battery in it. I'm pretty sure um, I sent one to the safety deposit drive during the intake last week. We need that battery, it's going to knock on the wall ahead, so. So I headed upstairs. This, I guess that's upstairs. So this, so this is how this. Okay, guess we'll be doing this the explodey way. Um, that's how that wall gets blown out in Resident Evil 2. Okay, I get, I, I get it. I get, I see what's happening here. I see story tying together. I see it. I still haven't found any um blue hoops here. That uh, lick of tongue fucking. trust any zombies lying on the ground at all do not trust yeah. oh, so that's why that is why that's why I have trust issues on this game it's exactly why I have trust issues on this game Oh, 
Oh, that hurts like a truck. Still a fucking boss, alright? Maybe, you know. Be a little scared. I'm still a boss, alright? Don't forget that. Oh. Alright, here we go again. Stay dead, bitch. Six, I might be on it. One, four. now. Nice. I like it. Can't do any of those. There's nothing in them. But there's nothing even in there. We're gonna leave it right there guys for episode four thanks so much for sticking out with us uh, it's been another crazy crazy adventure uh we're now on leon uh, sorry not leon's character um carlos's character he's definitely some um got some better artillery that's for sure i do miss the grenade launcher already but it's it's hella fun playing another character so tune in next time guys for the uh sorry i should say if you haven't already please hit that sub button um help support a small channel uh, if you guys could leave a comment, tell me if there's something I'm, that I'm doing that you like or something that I'm doing that you don't like. Constructive criticism is always good for somewhere that's a, a new YouTuber. And, uh, and we'll see you in the next one, guys. Peace.